So, two years ago, I made a video called Roasting Your Fursonas. And in, in the pinned comment section, I said, you know, I'm not doing a part two. Because I don't want to roast y'all's fursonas. Like, did I have fun doing it? Sure. But, you know, I don't really like to be mean. But despite the fact that I said that, despite, you know, I put in the pinned comment, I am not making a part two. Over and over and over again, people are like, oh my god, part two, part two, part two. You know, roast me, roast me. And you know what? It's been two years. Maybe it's been longer than two years. I don't remember how long it's been. I'm older now. I don't give a f- mm, Can I cuss? Um, I don't care as much anymore about whatever. So, sure. You know, that was one of my most popular videos ever. So, sure. Why not? Why not? Let's just do it again. So I made a tweet. I made a tweet. You know, reluctantly. Yeah. Drop a ref of your fursona if you want me to roast them. Don't respond if you love your fur child because I'll be mean. And of course I got 700 replies because, you know. Y'all, oops. Anyway, of course I got 700 replies because y'all just want to be- I think it's more than 700 now, but I don't- I don't care. Whatever. Anyway, I said I'm thinking this time I might not script it and just scroll through and then say the first thing I think of, which is what I'm doing right now. This is not scripted, I just turned on my- you know, laptop, connected my microphone, and now I'm talking. So I'm obviously not gonna go through all of these personas. I'm just gonna start scrolling, and when I get tired, I'm gonna stop. So, you know, if you don't get picked, tough luck. Uh, there's 700 things here. I even locked the tweet after 24 hours because I knew, I knew y'all were gonna be like this, and even 24 hours was too much time for y'all. So, let's go. Uh, I'm older and meaner now, so let's start. Shakes like a leaf in the wind. Good, be fucking afraid. Okay, biscuit by Solar Pobs, already ripping off my name, uh, Solar Saber Wannabe. Let's see, um, uh, this is actually kind of hard to roast because I really like Parappa, they got the Parappa. Anyway, let's see, what can I roast about this? Biscuit the Poodle Mutt, so I already know your dog has behavioral issues, number one. What are you wearing, first of all? You know, baggy pants are cool, I'm not gonna go to- I have a pair of baggy pants like that, so I'm not gonna go too into it. Ultra Ball Studs, okay, so you're edgy. Probably autistic. That is not a roast, by the way. I'm just making observations. Blendable? Like, I can put your persona in a blender and just kill them? Is that what you mean? What are you talking about? What? <laughs> this dude looks like I- Like, if I were in a nightclub, like, they look like they would come up to me and be like, Bro, do you- You wanna smoke this fat blunt with me? And I'd be like, No, you know, I don't- No, I don't want to. And they probably wouldn't even know what I was saying because they'd be too high to understand. And comprehend. Is this butterfly like a tattoo or is it like part of the- I don't know. Um, this is a lot harder to do unscripted guys <laughs> before I wrote out like I planned out roast in in my script last time I did this but I'm just I'm just going from my head now. Do your worst. Ah, uh, this is hard. I like- uh, y'all know I'm a big cat enthusiast. Like OMG that's actually really cute. Like yeah I kind of agree. Okay what can I roast about this one? Vera. Where are your teeth bro? Where's your tongue? What? Should I roast artistic ability in this one? I mean, I don't know. I, I think the- I, I like the art a lot. But, I'm not gonna lie, this is extremely generic. Like, <laughs> I feel like I've seen so many tiger- Tiger? Is this a tiger? I don't know. I think I've seen so many big cats that look exactly like this. Maybe a, like a hue shift, a color change, like a slight color change. But I've seen this design so many times. It's not original. It's pretty. I'll give you that. It is pretty, but it's not- I've seen it so much. That- that's mainly all I have to say about that one, because I don't- I don't have too much in my brain. Ravioli, male Jeanette- I don't even know what that animal is. I couldn't tell you. Um, Ravioli. Okay. Just based on that name alone. Gay. Neurodivergent. Probably. What is a Jeanette? Jeanettes are slender, cat-like animals with a long body and a long ring tail, large ears- What is this thing? <laughs> Does it look like that? What is this? Uh, my roast is that the real life animal makes me uncomfortable. Bro, you look so long. Like, I don't know if it's because the actual animal is built like that, but this just- it feels uncomfortably long, this fursona does. Like, why- I understand it's a drop crotch, but it- it makes me uncomfortable. I don't like it. Ghost. Aussie Shep. Where? Where's the shepherd? Is it the- I mean, okay, I guess the pattern kind of looks like a shepherd. Aussie- Australian shepherd? Yeah, okay, I guess I kind of see it. Spots are random, probably because you don't want it to be like perfect and you don't really care about the placement of the spots. It's it's laziness love. I understand though. Don't forget about her butt heart. Okay. I, I don't even know what I would want to say about that. Let me <laughs> let me chill out. Cries blood? That is so fucking edgy. Are you kidding me? Cries blood? 
What are we in? 2010? Oh my god! <laughs> I haven't seen something like that since I was nine years old. What the hell? I can already tell this video is going to be lower quality than the first part I did, simply because of the fact that it's not scripted. I was about to say these these um, pieces of jewelry scream lesbian, but I just saw the buy flag, so I'm not gonna say that anymore. Cause I have I have this exact same pair of cherry earrings. <laughs> There's like on my desk right now. Is this that Trigun dude, but in furry form? What is going on here? I've never watched Trigun or read it. Okay, what is your name? Is it Gus? Is it like is it literally your Twitter name? What? Okay. Brain rot, obviously. Anime, weeb. Trigun. Okay. I think that I could, you know, I'm gonna look so dumb if it's not Trigun and I'm just assuming it is. What are you? Wait, is this like just for funsies? We got little fish whiskers or cat whiskers? Oh my god, what is your species? Are you a bear? Is it, is it a dog? Is it a raccoon, but yellow? What's happening? This is one of my mutuals, so I'm gonna- I'm actually so upset that I don't know the species of your fursona. Bro looks like a Care Bear, kind of. I don't know if that, <laughs> I don't know if that's a good comparison. Yeah, my main- my main roasts here are Weeb, Weeb Brain Rot anime, uh, Touch Grass, probably. Make him cry more than in the first image. This is happy and he can change forms, his arms are clout- You're crying right here, bro? Where are the tears? Why are you smiling and crying? I just- I don't- Is it like- Am I supposed to assume he's crying from the sad faces on- on the ears? Is- Are these ears? I don't know. I can't tell. What is this? I, is this some- Is this a cat? Furries try not to make your species ambiguous challenge. What is this? Like, what am I looking at? I still can't get over the fact he's supposed to be crying in this first image. It's not conveyed at all. These are two different characters. He can change forms, his arms are clouds. Like, I understand changing forms, but this is like- They look like they could be like siblings or something. This is original. I'll give them that. I haven't seen something like this before. But this is giving kid core. Definitely kid core. Probably some love core. Uh, I diagnosed this person with probably- probably gay. I knew it. Okay, I knew it. Anyway. Uh, okay. What's- Ren the cat. Cat? Cat is a stretch, honestly. Like, I see the cat elements. But it, it kind of looks like like it could be also a small dog, if we're being honest. Cat cat is quite is like a tiny bit of a stretch. Okay, we got the fire powers, very original. JK, it's not. I can't find the word for it right now. But this outfit, it's negative. I can't I I'm, I can't tell you why, but it is. Also, this hairstyle right here, it's a hairstyle I see in a lot of furries. It's just it's so generic to me. Like I I feel like this specific hairstyle is like. You see it and you're like furry, but not in a good way. Like furry, furry parentheses negative. Like that's that's what I'm feeling right now. Soft. Okay, so is every other fursona on here probably. It has fur, obviously. Okay, cake. Ube sheep. I think that's a food. Star pupils. Oh my god, Steven Universe. Ink patterns random. Yep, there we go. We got another too lazy to make this on model, so we're doing random, random spots. Which again, understandable. We also got like two forms here, like we got like just regular sheep and sheep with shaved top, which, okay. Is it like one's a winter coat and one's like a summer coat thing going on we got here? Like, what? Why does that pop heads? Sheep have hooves. I mean, I get it's the furry fandom, so you can do whatever you want and it doesn't matter. But like, that really just threw me off. Why do you have paws? <laughs> Alternate pupils look like goat pupils also. Do sheep also have rectangular pupils? Am I just not remembering that? I want to roast that, but I can't remember, so I'm not going to. Oh, good lord. <laughs> this image tells me all I need to know about you, and you should be afraid by that statement. The fact that I need to tell you she's a tarantula might give- Yeah, it does, because I, I looked at this and I'm like, what is this? Like, okay, we got one, two, three, four, wait, I can't count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do tarantulas have six limbs? I don't know. This is on thin ice in terms of being a fursona. Like, this literally just looks like one of those anime, anim anime animal girls. Like, that's what this looks like. I, Charlotte too? Like from Charlotte's Web? We couldn't be more original? Dang! <laughs> I don't know if that was intentional or not, but it's really funny and I'm going to roast you for it. We got Charlotte from Charlotte's Web on here, not looking like a spider at all, except maybe the limbs and the eyes at most. Like this, this is looking like, oh my God. I don't know what else I can say about this. <laughs> Bro, d I, d okay. I clicked on this. There is way too much going on. Like, oh my God, there is so much going on in, on this ref sheet right now. 
that your character isn't even the main focus at this point. My eyes hurt. My eyes hurt looking at this, genuinely. It's so, there's so much, like, composition-wise, there is too much happening right now. Let me actually focus on the persona though, oh my god. This is so, this is like overly complex. I can barely read this handwriting too, but that could just be me. Orion, Griffin, Chubby, they, them. Cosmic energy, spicy foods. Okay, dislikes large claws, strong. Liars? I mean, who doesn't dislike liars? Obviously, what? what? Griffin, do griffins have paws? I thought they had claws. Griffin, I am not getting griffin from this. Maybe I don't know what a griffin looks like, but this, this looks like a, bird but like mixed with maybe a big wolf or dragon based on this tail it's definitely a unique character design i'll, I'll give you that Th there is so much there's just if i had to give some advice when you get a reference sheet make the background solid color so i can actually tell what the hell is going on that that's what i'm gonna say this looks like a knockoff busy pop character why are they only in their underwear you can either put clothes on them or have them be naked and furry. Why are we picking the in the middle? To make me uncomfortable? Is that why you did this? J put on some clothes or just walk around with fur. What pick one? Damn. Also, what is this? Lion, lion tail, lion muzzle, goat, ram horns. But also, what kind of, what is this? I don't Oh my god, then we got hooves too. I'm just going to this is probably some made up creature that I don't know about. Anyway, my advice, put some clothes on, please. Yeah, you definitely had to tell me this was a lichen rock because I look at this, it just looks like a dog. Uh, I do not see the Pokemon in this anywhere, except for it, like, eyes change with their emotions. Edgy. Edgy. Overdone. Huge foodie? Yeah, I mean, we can tell. Yeah, my main- my main roast here is that this literally just looks like a dog. It doesn't look like a lichen rock. it doesn't look like a Pokemon. This just looks like a dog persona. Oh my god. Clown. Queer. He, they, it. Pick a struggle, bro. Pick a struggle. We got- we got gay, trans, clown. Pick one. This is just- <laughs> This is just one of like the- not the edgiest persona I've ever seen. Definitely not the edgiest, but this just feels like so try-hard like, Ooh, I'm a clown. I got a hatchet. Oh my god, I'm gonna chop you up because I'm a clown and I'm evil. Like, that's what this feels like. Evil clown. Girl, look at my teeth. Like, you're trying so hard. Bro. <laughs> I had to do this one, because this is ridiculous. Is this not the default furry avatar on Roblox? I don't play Roblox, so I don't know. This is honestly embarrassing, actually. Because <laughs> imagine you're commissioning someone and you say they ask you for your ref sheet, and you send them this. I would, I would not take you seriously. I'd be like, what is this? Are you for real? Is this not the default? Oh, I'm, I'm moving on. We wouldn't have the roasting persona video complete if we didn't pick one with a free to use base. First thing that pops out to me, I hate this color palette. I think these colors go together atrociously. It looks like you're wearing pants. I don't know if that was the intention. Green and pink and white can, can work together, but not like this, not like this. Oh my God, every single one of your paws has a different color, but you didn't color it in correctly. Is that what you did? Like, over here on the left, it's saying, like, red paw, yellow paw, black paw, green paw. But when you colored it in, all the paws are red. Maybe we should pay attention to detail, maybe, a little bit. My advice here would be to make the green lighter, because it, it kind of just looks bad, in my opinion. I wanted to say fuck boy, but the, the pronouns are they, she. Fuck girl? Fuck rabbit? Draconic rabbit? Dragon rabbit? I've never seen that. Points for uniqueness. This one's actually kind of hard to roast, I'm not gonna lie. I'm seeing more dragon elements than rabbit. Like, it's mainly giving dragon. The only thing giving rabbit is- are like the ears. Maybe the nose a little bit, but it's like, th this is a dragon. Furries love to like make hybrids and then it kind of just looks like one part of the hybrid. I love that the pattern of the magic harps don't vary at all. Like, you just slap that pattern on there and didn't, you know, account for the fact that the shirt is indeed bending and twisting at points. Love to see it. I do the same thing, so not too much of a roast. These shorts scream dad. Yeah, it's- it, this entire character just screams gay. Like, that, that's what I'm saying. There's no way this is like- Garfield, are you serious or are you joking? Ouse? This is actually really funny. <laughs> Ouse, mouse without the M. What is this? <laughs> Who are you? Real artist, CEO of Alice. It's got no nose. It's got no legs. It only has a tail and eyes. How do you move? How do you get where you're going? Does someone carry you? Oh my god, Alice. Alice. It's like I'm saying ow because I have to roll around everywhere because I have no fucking legs. 
All right, homie, I can't read any of this. That text on the blue background, it does not work. I can barely, I'm not good at reading cursive in the first place. These proportions are so exaggerated. I, I can't take it seriously. Oh my God. What is this? What is this? Are you a cat? Feline? Cow? Not cow. I just said that because of the tail. Uh, likes her girlfriend. Oh my god, win! Heterochromia. Oh my god, she has homophobia in her eyes. What is the species? There's nothing explicit showing, so I am gonna show this on the screen. But like, I, I already know this probably has an NSFW reference sheet also. Like, I wouldn't be surprised. This looks like if I opened DeviantArt in 2013, this would be on the homepage. Um, we have a lot of personas on here that seem to be stuck in the past. Yeah. Long legs, long legs and big paws. Okay, clumsy. Fur on his feet usually cover his paw pads. Okay, that's, <laughs> that's definitely a design element. Okay. I mean, it, realistically that makes sense, especially if you grow out uh, fur and stuff, but I don't like it. I don't like how it looks. Actually, this is, makes me uncomfortable. I don't like that. The more I look at it, the more uncomfortable I get. I don't like that design element choice. <laughs> Does this even count as a fursona? Is this a lobster? Or- no. What is this? Okay, these are two- okay, two of them, never mind, it's two different characters. Okay, the roast I have on this one, I don't know what this is. I was thinking lobster tail, isopod, sea creature, at mantis? What is this? I don't know. I- it makes me uncomfortable. I don't like bugs. Uh, maybe that's why it makes me uncomfortable. I don't like this design. I- I just don't like it. Do you have no face? I don't know if the bucket is a design choice also. These images are so low quality too. Oh my god, I can barely- I barely escaped the mental asylum. I can tell. Cause what's going on in your brain to create this? I- I think I had to roast this one because I did draw it. <laughs> this person commissioned me to make their reference sheet, so let's- It- okay. It's gonna be kind of hard to roast something I drew. But, you know, I think I can. These paws are huge, actually. <laughs> like, if you put these paws on your face, I think they cover all of your face and more. Also, like, snow. Like, why? Is this supposed to be pronounced like snow? Or is this a word I don't know about? Why can we not say snow the bunny? Snow? Kind of reminds me of, like, Spongebob. Like, we snow. That's what this sounds like to me. This expression. Head empty. Absolutely no thought think. Absolutely nothing in that brain. And then we have, like, one singular flower for, like, you know, uniqueness. You know, gotta have something to stand out from the other rabbits, I guess. I don't understand the fascination with mushrooms. I know so many people are into mushrooms and stuff. I don't get it. I don't like mushrooms. I don't like how they taste. I don't like how they look. But th this is just becoming a personal rant on mushrooms. This this makes me think this fursona is fungus infected, which yes, literally, I get it. But seeing the mushrooms grow out of your tail, like, th this thing has to be dying soon. Like, what? The, the fungus is gonna take over your body like a paris a parasect from Pokemon, and you're gonna become a husk of yourself and a zombie. This thing looks high as hell. I don't know if that's the just the design choice of how the eyes are drawn, but it it does. Her name is Cider. Okay. Had maybe a too many cups of hard cider. That's what it looks like here, Cider. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna roast here is the fact that you have shading on your reference sheet. Artists hate you. We don't like shading on the reference sheet. That That's the number one roast I have here right now. Um, the second one is if- if you put- I don't know what species this is, but I've seen it so many times. A mano kit? Is that what this is? Probably. If you put this up against any other anime looking mano kit, I could not tell you the difference. This- this looks like generic mano kit. Uh, looks like every other mano kit I've seen. Have mercy? Why would you reply to this thread if you wanted me to have mercy? Bro, that's a dumb decision. Anyway, this thing looks depressed as hell. Oh my gosh, we even have the blood color. So this this artist is probably edgy. She, they, he. Okay, all pronouns. Musk deer? What is that? Is that like a deer with... What is a musk deer? Hold on. Why is it called a musk deer? Is it because of the... Do they stink? Traditional East Asian medicines to treat a variety of ailments relating to the heart, nerves, and breathing. So we get like... So, so you... We like get your secretions and make medicine out of it? I love the crossed arm pose so we don't have to draw the hands. I'm guilty of that too. I know what you're doing. My final words on this one would be to take a damn nap. You look exhausted. You look sleep deprived. Maybe lay off the caffeine. That looks to be an issue too. Um, and that that is my first look opinion. You know what this looks like? Th this is like the, the cut my life into pieces. This is my last resort. This is what this looks like, actually. I hope y'all liked my emo uh, song reference. Rowan, he, they. Oh my gosh, you have ferrets. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's, it's giving emo. Border Collie Australian Shepherd just kind of looks like a dog. What do these things mean? Oh, I hope I just didn't put a problematic thing on the screen. What does that mean? I have to look up these words. Okay. 
Just, okay, nectophilic just means extreme comfort in darkness. All right, cool. I, I hope that's not a sexual thing that I just put on here. What the hell does solve again? So, okay, so like a nomad? I, I don't know what this other one means. I hope it's nothing bad. <sighs> Look at that. The freaking 10,000th femboy furry I've seen since I've been in this damn fandom. I, I, I hate to keep using the term unoriginal, but it's like... I, I'm so tired of seeing femboy furries. I, there's too many. There's too many. There's a surplus. Y'all need y'all need to stop. Not really, I'm joking. But there is a lot of you. What is with all these characters with like dead eyes? Where's your mouth? Can you speak? Do you need help? Oh my god. Where are the pronouns? Where are the pronouns? He him. He doesn't have a mouth. Cat rooster hybrid. I have never seen such a thing. I'm oh my god. Talk about okay, you're indecisive. You have issues with indecisiveness based on how many variants and outfits this character has. Default, shiny, shiny, I don't even know what that word means. Lovely day, beast master. Oh my goodness. This character looks extremely smug and like they make fun of people. Like they would bully me and take my lunch money. That's what this looks like. Okay, well right off the bat we have ADHD. <laughs> I really like this drawing. Hold on. <laughs> Kind of looks like a reject from a band. Like, it, this looks like someone who would start or be in a band. And then, like, they're the one who has, like, too many issues going on. And they say stuff like, oh my gosh, guys, we have to be, like, we have to be part- d Damn it, what am I trying to say? <laughs> they're the one who says, like, we have to come together. We're a band. We're a family. And everyone looks at them like, girl, it's not that fucking serious. Chill out. That's what this character is. This looks like you used the transform tool on them in an art program, but you didn't keep the proportions and you squished it like and messed up the aspect ratio. Is that the right word? The not the aspect ratio. The proportions just in general. That's what this looks like. She's an original species I made when I was 12. Obviously because there's nothing original about this. Um this this just looks like maybe a lynx with wings, like a lynx cat with wings and very bright markings. Berry? Like oh it's got kind of like dragon fruit coloring. That's kind of cool. Yeah, what's the species supposed to be? It just looks like lynx cat wings. Is this supposed to look like an egg on purpose? Is that the intention? Cause this looks like a sunny side up egg. Fufetti? Is that a food that I don't know about? I don't know. This looks like an egg. It looks- it's like I'm- I want to eat it. I will- I will eat it and it will die because I love eggs. This first one looks like someone who originally drew humans mainly and then they decided to transition over to furry art. Cause this- this mainly looks like a regular woman just with cat face and tail. Even the way she drawn on all three of these. Yeah, it's giving human artist, now trying to draw furry, still looks like a regular woman, but with, you know, cat features. Oh my gosh, this video wouldn't be complete without some- something named neon and with bright colors. I know we already had a bright colored green one, but now we have another bright colored green fox husky fusky. Great! Likes getting pushed into social situations? That's a new one. Um, good for you, I guess. What is this hairstyle we have going on? What is- like, what is happening here? Is this like a weird mohawk that's kind of overgrown? Likes green, obviously. <laughs> I hope you would like the color you are. Five Nights at Freddy's Enjoyer. Five Nights at Freddy's Enjoyer. It's just- it- this art style specifically just screams Five Nights at Freddy's to me. Is this even a roast at this point? This just looks like something I would see on animation meme YouTube in like 2015 maybe. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so it's obvious you use the symmetry tool, which can be great if used correctly. So, are the proportions off on purpose? Like, I don't know if this is purposeful, but it doesn't look like it. So, these are how the Pixar moms are built. Like, absolutely no waist, huge hips in comparison to the rest of the body. I feel like if you put your arms down, they would go past your feet. I know realistically they wouldn't. We have the eyes looking in two different directions. Th yeah, this is giving- I used the symmetry tool for the first time and didn't think about how this would look comp- like, as a whole picture. Can be drawn as either a river otter or sea otter. Okay, indecisiveness. Good to know. This isn't giving river otter at all. Like, this is only giving sea otter. Which is why it confuses me, like, can be drawn as either a river otter or sea otter. Does that mean if you draw them as a, a river otter, you would change their colors? Or, like, would you change- the shape of that thing? I don't know. This is just giving sea otter. That's what it's giving to me. All right, y'all. I already know that this is probably less funny than part one because, like I said, it is unscripted. But, uh, 
there were way too many replies, so I just wanted to scroll and say what I first thought. Thank you so much for watching, and remember, shine bright.